Hello everybody, my name is Bleeker and welcome back to Map Quest: The Portal Crystals. In this episode, we should be able to get into Haybale Village. So, how to do that? First off, if you talk to the info guy here, he'll tell you, um, I'm the info guy, my free inf my free info for you is if you want to enter the Haybale Village, you need the shovel first. So, we need to talk to Lot the person in Lot 2. Also, you'll need a pickaxe better go to lot one. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get the pickaxe from lot one. Lot one and two this way. Oh, freezing up there a little bit. There we go. Lot one and two. Hey Bale Village, no. Set spawn point. So this is kind of how it goes. We need a pickaxe to get into the cemetery, into this uh, ruins. Hey, alright, there we go. Go to the windmill just south of my house. You'll find an old library below. If you clear out the creatures inside, you can have my shovel. I know you're probably thinking, just give me the shovel, but that is the problem. I don't have it is in the library below the windmill. Oh, alright. That's where our meetings took place. So, in order to get the shovel, we actually have to go and clear out this windmill that's over here. A main quest 7, shovel side quest. Oh, that's map icons. I don't need that. This one could just go up here. But I need to go speak to the person in lot one because we're going to need a pickaxe at some point to get another portal crystal. Here's lot one. Very briefly. Hello there. I heard you're looking for portal crystals. Um, well, have you seen the old runes near my house? There might be one down there. Um, old rune pickaxe. Sweet. Alright, so basically, what Zara is saying is if we go in here, let's see, there should be, there it is. So this pickaxe will allow us to get into the old ruins that were over by the info guy, but we don't really need to do that right now. We're going to get in the Hay Bale Village this episode. So in order to do that, we need to go into the windmill here and clear it out of, like, everything. Trust me, this one is not an easy task to do. This, this is going to take us uh, a bit of time to clear out the windmill. There's actually a whole dungeon underneath. It's actually pretty cool. ta -da! Into the depths. I don't believe there's any chests in this area. Oh, so uh, this is meeting places in the old library. I should look for a door to the library. I believe the door is back here. There it is. Oh, hello. Help me. I am... Oh, this is my brother. Help me, Bleaker. I am trapped inside the portal realm. Sometimes I can find a weak spot and I can talk to you like now. I'm in no danger here. I have... I have food, but I don't want to be trapped here forever. Oh, the barrier is closing. Come find me. I will be waiting. Yes, let me. Let me go, please. Thank you. I might need that. So essentially, while we're in here in the library, we got to clear it out of basically every mob that we come across. Ah, here's the library. This is the hidden entrance to the library that we need to clear out. And we need to clear it out of every single mob. Which sucks, but it's not too terribly difficult to do. Oop, something back here? Nope. On to the next. Oh, that was completely unexpected. A bookkeeper. Nope, nothing over there. Nope, two mobs over here. Mm -hmm. 
wood bug dead. Another wood bug. Bookkeeper. Uh, old librarian. Skeleton. Old librarian. Basically, your best course of action is to just run through this bottom portion of the library first, which we have now successfully cleared, then go upstairs and clear out the bottom portion. Good. I do apologize if I seem a little rushed this episode. I'm actually kind of short on time, which kind of sucks, but it's the only time that I could find today to record. So got a quick get through here and get to the Haybell Village so I can start rendering. So then, oh, chest over here. Chests over here, my apologies. Bread, coin. And then I don't remember if this is anything good. Oh, more bread and coin. Lots of silver coins, which is good because we're gonna need these at some point believe we're going to need just silver coins. So if you've got a couple of stacks of them, it's going to it's going to serve you well to say the least. Ooh. Money bag. Eh. Oh yes, this Wait for it. Cutscene. Shink. I think Mick spawned more stuff at this point. Almost done clearing out this area. thinking on it, I don't believe we need to clear out the whole area. I believe you can just um, press through and be fine. Hmm. I'll have to consult the man. Alright. Then you're going to want to set your spawn point. Oh no! No! No, that was not the spawn point. That was not the respawn point. I hate that sign. That got me the last time I played through the map, too. And I was testing the map. That got me. That got me. That gets me every time. I'm not paying attention. I'm used to them being spawn points. Ugh. Note to self. Pay closer attention. Still doing good on time. So allow me to redo this. Go through here. Don't touch that. Right click here to set spawn point. So there's a wall here. The shovel's in there. Now you can get hints, but honestly I'm not very stuck because these, I'm not really sure what they are, but you can kill them. And if you kill all of them, whatever they are, it opens up the door. ta -da! And then, shovel. Now we can get into the Haybell Village. Alright, need that to enter the... Oh god. Person running at me. Librarian. What do you have to say, sir? Halt, that's my shovel. I stole it, now prepare to die, thief. That's my shovel. I stole, now prepare to die, thief. Hmm. Easy. Now we can teleport the hell out of Dodge. And then, out we go. Now that we've completed that, let's get into the Haybell Village. Now the info guy, if you speak to me, tells you dig under stuff that's red. It's 
important. As you can see here, there's this red tree. And you'll notice, there we go. Oh, crap, there we go, sorry. Um, can break through soul sand anywhere. Well, this looks like soul sand to me. <gasps> a ladder. So go through this tunnel. Chest and stuff, I don't need any of that currently. A note. Mayor's drop note. This place has become so gloomy. Everyone is miserable, including my brother who sleeps all day. All I need to do is get Lake M Memora's fortress gate open. Maybe opening the gate will make the villagers angry, but it might brighten up this gloomy town with more visitors coming and going. Hmm. That's all he's trying to do is get people in and out. ta -da! Welcome to the Haybell Village from the Secret Passage. The mayor shop. You find most of the villagers here don't like outsiders, but you're here to see the mayor who likes outsiders, although he has kept up the deception that he doesn't. Eh, mayor's house. Yellow. Hello, Mr. Mayor. I need to enter the West Oakland and the Seven Mages Village. Can you help me? I don't know that how you got in here, stranger, but I know that you're here. I could use your help. You know, you could do me a favor. You know, could you do me a favor if you do me a favor if you do a favor if you do a favor yeah whatever i need you to go to memora's fortress gate and find a way to open the gate if you speak to the gatekeeper he might have a solution to opening the gate to reach the fortress gate just follow the path signs you'll see they will lead you back to the gate when the gate is open come back here and i will make arrangements so you can enter west Oakland in the seven mages village also, with the gate open, it might give my brother a reason to get out of bed, who just sleeps upstairs all day. I've actually never been upstairs. Oh, nothing I'm interested in for food. Oh. There he is sleeping all day. Interesting. Alright, unfortunately, I know this is a bit of a shorter episode, but that is all the time I have. Um, so that's how you get into the Haybill Village. When we come back, we're going to open up the Fortress Gate, and we are also going to get the um, Portal Crystal that is in the uh, ruins that are just over, way, over yonder. Over yonder. Over yonder. Who came up with over yonder? Anyways, um, that is unfortunately all the time we have. But until next time, guys, this has been Bleaker. Be seeing ya. <laughs>